Because I don't know. Are you kidding? A pop on the baby and it just and he just and he and he just hold me and get it and stuff on me. We died. Did you guys get any of that? Let's see what you got for Miss Sarah this time. Okay, good. You're at least walking in by yourself now. How was that? Was that the best one yet? Yeah. Did you jump off the cliff? Yeah. And you float on your back? Oh yeah, you're much happier. And you gave Miss Sarah a flower, didn't you? Now we're gonna get a reward of the playground. Thank God there's one next to us. Today was the best day, wasn't it? She kept asking to go on her back and asking to jump off the, the side multiple times. And she left happy, she entered happy, this is only day four. You're killing it. 10 more days yeah. for this round. Fist bump, they have a big fist bump. Hold this. Hold, oh, hold this animal. I'm just that, I'm just a carrying case. I think I had an idea. I think I figured out the formula. I have to hide behind something so I could see, but she can't see me, which is, I was telling Sarah that uh, I felt like such a creep doing that. I think a plan that we could do is that Ali will come behind us, maybe like a couple minutes behind us, and then once Remy's in the pool, I'll text Ali, she can come out of the car, and then she can hide there with me, so that way we're both visibly watching everything. You can practice, um, just in case I forget some things at the, the house. I'm, I'm really proud, I'm very, yesterday was a little rough, but that was day, this is day three, not day four. What am I doing? Uh, day two was a little rough, but number one was pretty awesome. Number three is killing it. She's, I, I don't think she was understanding it, but, Here's a fun story. My parents loved to keep telling me. When I was about Remy's age, the lady was teaching us, gave me, oh, look at you go. Gave me one last chance and then she was giving up on me. So it was like, I either, I swim that day or I fail and she stops teaching me because she couldn't do it. And I was so afraid that she would be the same way. Who am I kidding? She's way better at everything that I ever was. Was nervous, but now I'm so pumped and so relieved right now. We had to pull over the pirate ship because Remy's been finding treasure. It's funny, as a kid, I used to think these were the coolest thing, too. You know what these are called? Yeah. Squirrel toothbrush. These are with field. It's called a squirrel toothbrush. It's day two of swim lessons, so we're celebrating with some Evos, which is like Turtle's favorite place in the entire world. We got some french fries, when we wanted french fries and a milkshake, so we thought, let's go get some air fries and a really yummy milkshake to celebrate day two of swimming. Did you have a good time? Yeah. What did you do? Did you swim far? I jumped off the cliff. That's so cool. No, nope, not yet. You can have this later. Gotta eat your french fries and your milkshake. Can't believe I'm saying. Gotta eat your french fries and milkshake before you can have a lollipop. How is it? Is it delish? How's yours? Oh, you haven't even taken a bite yet. Here you go. I gotta make sure you clean them up, Fram. Thank you, bud. Get his face. Good job. Thank you. You did a great job. Watch out for your for your ketchup, okay? Sharing with Dad. I don't even have to do anything. You're so silly. I don't know how I created a monster, but one day I turned my computer on. I know. I turned on the computer and the Roblox icon was on the desktop, and she already knows what it is because a cookie, good old cookie swirl. Thank you, cookie swirl. See, she kind of ruined Remy. Okay, so she saw the little Roblox icon, and now we have to come upstairs to play computer games, which is cool, but I've discovered you can also do it on the iPad, but it's
I swear, if anyone can hook up a uh, cookie swirl with us, I would love to meet her. Free tickets for life to We The King shows, backstage passes. I'll bring on the bus. No, the fun duck. That's right. Say, so cookie swirl can come on the tour bus. Sophie, going to toy bus. Yep, so it's an invitation. Get it to her. I need to change it to Remy has no game. And there's Mr. Flanders. We're also thinking of some really fun things like, you know, back in the day where it was like, you know, we did Cooking with my two-year-old, unfortunately, now she's three, so we'll have to reboot it a little bit. But I wanted to do those things where kids say the darndest things. Kids say the darndest things. I want to come up with some really good questions. So in the comments, if you guys can think of... You gotta move the mouse. Are you gonna play with the Xbox controller? So I want you guys in the comments, Give me some questions that I can ask a three-year-old, just for hilarity responses. I don't have to watch the show because I don't know. Did you guys get any of that? I know that. Know that. In your life? That's her new thing. It's like, I've never done this whole thing in my life. Ever in my life, right? Ever in my life. Alright. Oh, wait. Alright, let's do this. Creeks the world, see? Okay, I can get behind. There's a whole bunch of Simpsons one now. I can get behind this. This donut hole one. This is a donut hole one. Am I in town? You're in town. <laughs> but why is there a Simpson? No, this is not cool. I want you to be a Simpson. Now what do we do? Go this way. I'm gonna go in. It's not a touch screen. That one? Okay. Hello. Wow. Be what Simpsons. I don't understand it. Grandpa, there's Lisa and Ma. Uh, no, yeah, Lisa and Maggie. Wait, what happened to your body? body? Oh, you're Maggie now. Ah! What is this thing? Maggie. You're Maggie once for Halloween. Ah! Oh, now you're Lunch Lady Doris. No, and Jimbo. I'm oh, no. now you're Mo. I, I want to be Lisa again. Ah! What is the point of this game? Here's Lisa. Hello. Hello. Hey, you're, you're Lisa. Hello. AKA the worst character. Ah! I have a little instance that we all had, we all shared with the actress of Lisa. Don't want to get into it too much, but it was a very disappointing situation. Anything Lisa is no good by me. Where am I going? I don't know. This is real. Go be the dog. Hello. I don't understand this game. Is there a point to it? It is a go. I have no idea. I know it is. Am I going now? There's some games I just I don't understand. Oh, here's a fun little fact though. I j I'm seeing this because of this. Like when Lisa and Bart asked Marge and uh, Homer where they came from, like the story of how they were born. If you go and you look at the paintings, when they're like showing, like talking in the background where there's like a flashback, Marge is actually, we'll do another one. Marge is actually pregnant and you look in the background, you see Maggie, Maggie's photo already born on there. What is it? I showed you. Lisa is weird. Yes, she is very weird. Remy like recently got really obsessed with actually playing games. She used to just watch them on the internet all the time, and now all she wants to do is play them. Oh my god, what happened up here? A bomb went off. A bomb went off. Well, you know, tornado, child. That's what we like to call Remy is a straight up child tornado. I was downstairs and I was getting like a bunch of the lawn work done and all that stuff. Anyways, we're getting back into the swing of things. So like, I always saw you. It always takes us like a few days to get like readjusted after we either go on vacation or after we have somebody in our house. And I feel like this past month has just been like, I don't even really feel like we've had a real moment to ourselves. Like, I don't wanna say a moment to ourselves in our house because that sounds stupid because we've had moments to ourselves, but like we had Nerd Rock come and then we went to Fort DeSoto and then we went to the Springs and then my sister came and like July is done. It's just gone. It's over. It's done. You know, once Remy finishes up her swim lessons, which it's only day three, I have not gone yet. I feel a little bit guilty about it, but Tara straight up said to me that it's really important that 
like she goes by herself. I'm the one that like she like gravitates to when she's upset. And he said that maybe tomorrow I can go. He thinks it might be a good time. I'm, I kind of want to go because I kind of want to watch so I can like bring back what she's learning here. And then that way I can apply it here with her. After that though, after the swim lessons are done, again, the like Florida RV road trip is gonna kind of continue. We're gonna check out another really cool place in Florida. Gas has been going down drastically here, which makes me really hopeful about what we plan on doing in like September, October. I think it actually might be the best time because it'll be cooler. It won't be as crowded and all the above. We actually have a friend that lives in California and she sent us this like yesterday, what the prices were like a week ago in California. This is insane, okay? Do you see this? Like this is insane. These prices are insane. Ours right now, like the one by us is like 377, which is still pretty high, but it's not nearly that bad. And then my older sister said hers is like close to six and she's in Colorado. I just got out of the shower. Allie called to uh, tell me a little story. I'm gonna let her tell you guys the story because I think it's pretty crazy. I went to Trader Joe's, but I was like, oh, I gotta get some sunscreen for Remy because she's been, you know, we've been outside and we've been in the pool. Swimming. And I was like, oh, I'll just get everything, sunscreen for us. And I was like looking at their little sunscreen area. Hey guys, like, let me guess. You're here for the TikTok sunscreen. I was like, the what? I was looking for sunscreen, but I don't know anything about a TikTok sunscreen. He's like, well, I guess we have like the knockoff brand of the Goop sunscreen that's, I don't know how much, but it's a lot more expensive. Isn't Goop Gwyneth Paltrow? Yeah, her, her company, but I guess it's like- I know stuff. I know you do. So apparently it's like the knockoff version of that. And so people are buying it and then they're selling it online and making a ton of money off of it. Because and we have one. It's, I guess, all over TikTok. It's supposed to be a knockoff of the, the Goop sunscreen. I was like, I guess I should just get one. He's like, you should get one. The guy was like, I bought one. Or I bought two of them because I'm gonna sell them. This is gold. I literally feel like right now- You have TikTok gold. I have TikTok gold. So let the bidding begin at, how much was it? I wanna say it was like under $8. Let the bidding begin at $9, guys. Anyway, we'll see you tomorrow.